Christie Metropole has really impacted the city of Los Angeles and the cats who live here in a very profound way. I mean, there would be thousands and thousands and thousands of more unwanted cats and kittens who probably would have been euthanized if, you know, Christie had not focused on helping the homeless cats a decade ago, or actually it's been 15 years. And, um, you know, thank God for her. Christy is, is not only a visionary in realizing so much that can be done to help community cats, stray cats, but also through her advocacy work. She's realized that it's not just the work that she and her volunteers do on the ground, but also advocating with the public and for changes in public policy. Christy has a very powerful voice and she's not afraid to use it, as most of us know. Christy saw a problem. She saw all those cats out there on the streets and she has such a big heart. She had to do something about it. And, you know, so she, she did something that most people wouldn't do. Most people just walk on by. They may just say, oh, poor cat. And, you know, and then shrug their shoulders while Christy rolled up her sleeves and actually starting taking action. Early on in her, uh, her career as a rescue person, she changed our lives totally and she was our inspiration and we are forever indebted to her. She literally scaled a, a wall in an industrial section of LA to trap uh, an injured kitten and when we read the story we ended up um, being so taken by it. It was a story about Stubbs the cat who had chewed off parts of two of his legs after he'd been set on fire and was dying from the gangrene and Christy was determined to get Stubby and she did and it forever changed our lives. It got us into the rescue movement and that's, I think, why she does what she does and it's how she inspires so many of the rest of us to do what we do. Christy means the world to me and Pam and to Bravo, the cat formerly known as Stubbs. <laughs>